All right, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Gunfish TV. I'm out here on the Nottaway River today. Uh, brought my daughters out here to the river with my mom. We're having a little cookout. Brought the kayaks and stuff. Uh, but what I'm gonna do, I wanted to fish with something a little different today. And what I'm gonna attempt to do is catch some gar on a modified chatterbait with a piece of nylon rope on the back. Now, I don't know if y'all are familiar with how to catch gar like that. Basically, they bite the rope and their teeth get entangled in it and you're able to reel them in that way. So I'm gonna try to catch one. I saw a bunch of gar right here around the corner where I'm going to go. It is extremely hot today. Uh, so I'm just gonna mess around and kind of do that. Hopefully catch a citation gar, at least catch a gar for y'all. That'd be pretty cool to do. And also I have some underwater footage of uh, some red throat on the beds. And I think that'll be pretty cool. That will be coming up right after this intro and then we're going to get to trying to catch the uh the gar on the chatterbait and i'll show y'all how i rigged that up so let's go ahead here's the red throat and then we're going to start fishing for some gar after All right, so basically you have a chatterbait, and this is a jackhammer chatterbait. You might want to use a little bit cheaper one, but this is the one I have tied on now, and they were chasing this one earlier. And I have a piece of nylon rope that I've opened up the ends on and got it all nice and frizzy. You want to get it, you want to kind of comb it out and get it nice and frizzy like that right there. And then you want to take the end and you want to take a lighter and burn the end of it. All right, so you got that so it won't come unfrazzled. You want to take your bait, take your hook without sticking the hook in your hand now. You don't want to do that and run it right through the rope just like that. So now you have this right here. All right, so let me throw that in the water and see what that looks like. All right. We're gonna see if we can get us one. Let's get this chesty on. Let's go out there. Hopefully a few are still laid up. We're gonna throw up there. Maybe we can get us a great big citation This gar. thing is gonna get us a big old gar. I can feel it. Hopefully they're still out here. I wish I'd have had this on. I kind of thought about messing with some gar today anyway, or some blackfish, or some of y'all know them as mudfish, grindle, whatever you want to call them, um, just to do something a little different. But I saw a bunch of gar right here and I threw the chatterbait in front of them and they were biting the chatterbait, but they just weren't getting the hook. They were biting at the trailer. So we're gonna come out here, we're gonna make some cast. Hopefully we can get us one. Oh God. Now yeah, we're definitely not gonna get us one like that on the very first cast. Oh God, one just rocked it. I mean, just absolute. I can't believe I didn't get him. All right, so we're getting bites, but we're not, we're not hooking up. I don't really know why. Got it. Well, I thought I had that one. Thought I had that one, but I didn't.
Well, he is not the big one that we wanted, but we got us a darn gar. We got us a gar. He is not the one we wanted, but we finally got us one. He is teeny, teeny. Check that dude out. <laughs> he is teeny, but it worked. It worked. The old rope little worked. I don't know why I couldn't get them big ones, but. I'm gonna take them up there and show the kids. Finally got one. Take them up there and show the kids. Let him go. See, it worked, y'all. Told you it did. Told y'all it worked. Last cast right here. Last cast. Go back up. We're cooking some hot dogs. Had a fun little evening. I haven't fished very long. I haven't fished very long at all. Got frustrated with these guard. I wanted to finally catch one, so I got one to take up there and show the kids, so they'd be excited about that. But I was hoping to get a great big one, but that's all right. That is okay. Fun little afternoon. So this video was a little bit something different for y'all. We had a cookout out, uh, you know, on the river that afternoon. And I wanted to try to catch a gar for the kids to see. Some of, some of the kids that were there had never seen one. And then also there were brim beds all along the shoreline. So I took the GoPro and put it up under the water. Pretty cool to see that male uh, red throat or red breast sunfish uh, chasing off those smaller sunfish and the minnows and stuff. Really cool to see that. He protects his bed just like a bass does. So uh, pretty cool underwater footage. I hope y'all enjoyed that. And it was a little bit of a challenge to catch a fish on that piece of rope, putting that piece of rope on the back of the chatterbait. But I was able to get it done. Got a small gar. Uh, the kids like seeing it. Got a cool little underwater release on him. So pretty happy with it. So I hope y'all enjoyed this. Go check out some of my other videos. And I'll see y'all next time on Gunfish TV.